She's napping. Finally, how'd you get her to do that? Oh, I, I made her a margarita. The tequila did the rest. It's Dr. Rushton. Her oncologist? Hey. Hey, hey Dr. Rushton. What, what are you doing here? Well, so much of my job is delivering bad news that I really wanted to tell you this in person. Lynette, I got the test results back. You're clean. Are you sure? Lip notes are completely clear. Congratulations. I knew it. I knew it. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? This is so amazing. I'm going to go get the kids. Hey, Doc, you look like you need a margarita. <laughs> and even if you don't, I ain't drinking alone. <laughs> There is much to be afraid of in this world, but what we fear has nothing to do with gruesome masks, or plastic spiders, or lifelike monsters. No, it's the thoughts in our head that terrify us the most. What if she comes to regret her decision? What if he really is unhappy? What if the chance for love has passed forever? How do we conquer these terrifying thoughts? We start by reminding ourselves what does not kill us just makes us stronger. 